Hey, hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sagar Pichapati and in this video I will be talking about how we can create a mapping column in our data frame in PySpark using Databricks. Okay, so for that, let's say I have this data, okay, ID name age and I want to get data like this. You know, name is mapping with uh, the actual name, like this all the column name, 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 and these all the column names, age, age, age. And here you can see I'm mapping with my uh, row value, right? Saga and the age, the value of age in, in of Saga is 25, right? So I'm writing here 25. Likewise, Alex 30, David 35. Okay, and I'm giving up one. I'm I'm giving this as a one name called map or you can you can give any other name so The same thing I have explained to you in my blog also Okay, you can see uh, This is my blog geek coders and here you can see how to map other columns of the data say in PySpark using database like I have given the example the full code also over here So if you want if you're looking out for the code or dummy data, then you can easily get it from this website Cool, and if you are new then please subscribe to my newsletter so that every time whenever I push a push a blog you will get a notification on your mail cool so chalo let's see how i can do that so for that what i'll do i'll just create a data frame a dummy data set cool so for that what i'll do i'll write here one saga and this is age so let's say 25 another row will be two alex and here let's say the age is 30 and likewise if I give another name called David, where the age is uh, 40. Cool, and let me give the ID also here. Cool, now, since this is the data, I created a data, right? Now I have to create a schema also. So the first column is integer, I can write int also. Second column is name, that is in a string format. And third column is age, which is in an integer column, integer format. Cool. Now let me create here data frame. So I'll write here is spark dot create data frame. Cool. Uh, data and schema. Right. And here just do a df dot show. See how simple is that? Hmm. Cool. So now I'll 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 create a new column. Cool. So for that. I will use create map column. So what I'll do, I'll just write here from PySpark dot SQL dot function import create underscore map column. Cool. Now let's create a new data frame. Let's say df underscore new is equal to df since we already have a data frame df dot with column. So what I'm doing here, I'm creating a new column. So the new column name is map, let's say. And here I have to use this, this, uh, this column, right? So let me give here create map. And here, what you have to pass, you have to pass the column. First, you have to pass the constant value. So in order to pass the constant value, you have to use LIT, correct? So I will use lit function and here I pass the name. I mean, I pass the string uh, string uh, data that is name. Cool. And second attribute is the actual value. So to get the actual value of this column of this row, I'll use here call function, right? Now what I will do, I'll just here show you df underscore new dot show now you can see over here that uh, the data look like this see name is saga name is alex name is david correct and uh, uh, now you know i want to make the same thing for the age column so how what i can do i can i can i can just copy this cool and put one comma and paste it over here and here i'll write here age and name i'll write here age cool so this is correct now let me run this again 
now you can see we have the data look like this but you can see when i do df underscore new dot show then you know it is showing i mean uh, the data is not showing properly right so i can make one property here truncate is equal to false so if i run this again then you can see we'll have we, we can see the whole data set uh, right the whole data frame we can see see now since we already have done the done the process i do not want this name and age column since i already have a map mapping column correct so for that what i can do i can simply write here drop and these column names so simple write here name and likewise you can write here age because i do not need those columns right now you can see we have this id and map now if you want to store this data into some layer then you can easily uh, write df dot new dot write dot save or if you want to you know uh, create a table out of it then you can easily write those commands so i hope you have understood this concept and this is very easy concept and i will be creating more videos on top of this please subscribe to my channel share with your friends and please visit to my website if you want to learn more things uh in a in, in a in a blogging in a in a in an article way right so this is the video explanation and that is that is a, a, a article explanation cool so chalo uh, stop cut this video ko and i hope you have another concept thank you bye bye